for doing another review. This is a rifle, a tw another tw uh, 22 rifle. And this one is kind of special to me because this is a Merlin Model 60, but with a twist. I did some modifications to it. This is a Merlin Model 60 tube fed tw 22 long rifle. Now, this used to be an old fashioned wooden stock, you know, plain old fashioned. But I did a mod to it. I put a Dragonov type stock on it, made by ATI. And for this type of gun, it is going for about $200 if you buy it with the wood. It's about $200. Uh, if you do the conversion like this, you're looking at about, they're about $75. And ATI does have these in stock, surprisingly. So if you wanted to make yourself a quick little pistol grip tw uh, 22 rifle, now is probably your chance to try to get a hold of one while they still got them in stock. Uh, like I said, it, it's easy to do yourself. I did this myself. Um, it only takes really a couple screws, screwdrivers, and it's, it's an easy fix. You can do it in about 10 minutes. Um, this has a, a tube fed. So here's the the charge handle. You can see it holds open because there's nothing in it. If there had been something in it, you know, it would have loaded. Uh, the release for it is at near the, tr the trigger guard. That's your release. Uh, it does have safety. You can push in and out right up here. And for loading it, it is a tube fed, which means right down here, you turn it, you pick this up, and it's got a plunger on the end of it, much like the Remington Nylon 66 does. It's got a plunger. This is where all the bullets go inside this tube. So when you're loading this, always remember to load with the bullet facing this way. And it takes about 14 rounds. Oddly enough, these are exempt from those so-called laws that they speak of, having more than 10 rounds because it's a tube mag. A tube mag. Uh, but it'll take about 14 rounds of 22 ammo. Once you've got it in there, you put the plunger in. It's going to start, it's not going to go in as easy as it came out. I'm going to have to push in on it a little bit. And then lock it into place. And you're ready to shoot and plink. This is a nice little plinking gun. I did this convert this conversion to make it more easy to um, use your face easier. You know, more easy to hold your, sho your shoulder, more easy to charge. You know, with having a pistol grip makes it more a, a little bit more accurate. I think, you know, you're, you're able to bet to better hand like hold on to it, maneuver it than you would if you had to shoot it like this. You know, it got more control this way. Um, I definitely say this is a favorite. I mean, you you can turn a. Uh, a little simple country 22 rifle into looking tactically cool. I mean, you can make it look nice for. You can do this mod under 300 bucks, and you're out the door. Although I will, I will say, with ammo prices being what they are, if you go out and do something like this and get this gun, even with buying ammo to go out and have a day of fun, you're probably looking at about 500 bucks, to, to tell you the truth. What used to cost like 
under 200 is now you're looking at close to $500 just to go out shooting with ammo prices being what they are. Um, I really like this. It's comfortable. It's lightweight. Uh, most of the weight is going to be where the barrel is. I mean, this is just a really nice gun. It's really easy to handle. Um, and it's really easy to put together as well. Um, if you have any comments, anything like that, any uh, if you like, if you'd like to share, share your co your comments, your ideas, and your experience with these types of rifles, you know, be my guest. You know, we'd love to hear from you. Um, with using this type of gun, I'd say the age range would probably be around maybe 10 to 14, you know. I mean, it's easy to use. It would be a good first gun for a youngster to learn how to shoot. Um, yeah. Well, don't forget, hit the subscribe button, hit the little bell. So you can stay up to date with all the videos that we're going to be releasing. And we're going to have way more videos to come. More reviews. Um, so just stay, stay tuned and share and subscribe. Thanks. God bless you all and God bless America.